Hey you guys, Cornstarch Creativity website is up and ready to make purchases. Click the description arrow and the link will be in there along with me and my son's apparel. Check out the website. Thank you. Hello you guys, so for one of my requests, I am to taste it and describe it, you know, so guess what I'm about to do. <laughs> okay, so I guess I can start with, it's going to be my friend, I was already using this from another video I just did, okay. I'm gonna go with my favorite one. This one has been my favorite for a while. I'm not gonna do nothing too big. Okay, that one was, to me, the reason that that one's my favorite is because, um, it, it doesn't have such a strong taste, if you get what I'm saying, like, what's the best way I can explain it? It's not like, some starches, you can actually taste a strong taste to it. Great value is kind of like, you know, that plain Jane straight to the point, you know, really, I'm going to say it's plain Jane, but it's good. No long way I can explain that one. It, do, it, it doesn't have like a strong, strong taste to it. You'd be like, oh yeah, I know this, um, this, or, you know, it's just, it's just good. Plain Jane and the head of the train. Okay. Hmm. Next one I'm going to do is good old Romford. I had this in the deep freezer. My teeth was sensitive to it, but this Romford tastes good in the deep freezer. Mm. Okay, that Romford, it is very good taste. The reason, and I'm going to say this, this don't even got nothing to do with this. I don't buy Romford like that. I got three cans of Romford. One I already used for a request. Another one is in my spec up stash <laughs> for later on. And I got this one that's pretty much almost gone. Romford is high. <laughs> it's real high. But it's almost like, you know how something is really expensive. You'd be like, well, it was worth it because uh, it tastes good or it looked good compared to something that's a little bit cheaper. I mean, no disrespect to um, Great Value, but Romford really tastes good. Great Value still my thing, but Romford really tastes good, especially cold. Yeah, unless you got sensitive teeth. If you got sensitive teeth now, don't put it in the deep freeze. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, so with this Brookshire brand cornstarch. Okay, so with this Brookshire brand cornstarch, I'm gonna say this, this is where, okay. I'm gonna just say eating cornstarch, the powder, it bursts in your mouth. You know, that's why some people choke sometimes. It bursts in your mouth. It's sort of like, you know, biting into a York peppermint patty. It's a sensation type situation, like where the fan blowing back and your hair all blowing in the wind and stuff like that. And it ain't even no fan right there. Powder, like when you chew it, it's all over. It's like dust everywhere. And that's where this come in, where I'm going to say, for some reason, I don't know how, but it is, believe me, this powder tastes thick. And I'm not talking about once you have it in your mouth and you chewing it on it so long that it get pasted. No, I'm saying the powder. It tastes heavier than other powders. Um, and you can tell it's a different flavor as well. Um, it's not like, you know, great value or other some other starches that it kind of don't have no taste. It's just like a powder, regular powder, no taste. But this one, the powder seems thick. It seems heavy, if you get what I'm saying. Okay. <laughs> Buckling that on down now. Okay. Hmm. There you go. Oh Okay, Argo. Argo is the people's champ. Um, it's the, to me, I think it's the number one used cornstarch. You can barely find it in Walmart when you need it. Not unless you're doing a pickup order and they go grab it real quick, but Argo is the, the people's champ. Argo got a, to me, it has a very good light flavor to it. Even though it's just powder, even though it's just the corn disintegration or whatever it is, to me, it it, it tastes like, uh, it just tastes like good powder. <laughs> I want to say what flavor it tastes like, but it don't taste like no flavor, it just tastes like powder. It tastes like, like a uppity powder. So why it's a little bit more than great value, okay? It is good though. It's not thick, the powder not thick. When it gets sweat, you know, all of it get like hard or whatever. But it's like very, very, very good grade of powder. And it tastes good. That's why it's my second favorite starch right here. Here, let's do this one. Mm -hmm. 
This starch right here, it to me, it gives me like, uh, it's not bad at all. It's good. Um, definitely got a, to me it has a individual recognizing taste to it. Um, like the other starches, it like bursts in your mouth. It's not thick. I know I keep saying Brooks is thick, but Brooks is powder is thick. This one I think is really good. And it got a nice aftertaste to it, which I like. I like this, the taste of this aftertaste and Argo in great value. The aftertaste on those, I mean, they good. It's not like, mm. what did I just say? It's really good. Ooh. has been in the house for a little minute. So now Kroger. I really like Kroger brand because it's kind of like great value. It really don't have no taste. Straight powder, no thickness, no distinction taste. Uh, great value, kind of, maybe it's a little sweet. Probably, I can't really explain it. But these two, great value in this, I keep bringing up great value, Ella style. <laughs> but this one, it really don't have no taste. It's really good. I like this one. Like I said, I like the ones that really don't have no taste. That it's kind of like plain Jane, not trying to do too much. Okay, let me say this about good old gluten. Gluten free. I don't like the aftertaste. Get off of me. I do not like the aftertaste. I'm not saying it's a horrible aftertaste. It's just aftertaste that I'm not messing with and I choose not to associate myself with. Every now and then, I did clab, clab a girl because I forget about the aftertaste that I don't like. Because you enjoy yourself. <laughs> You kind of enjoy yourself, you know, throughout the process. It's just that um, after you, you know, take it out and it leaves that little weird reminder in your mouth. 
I just, I just don't like it. But the journey, the beginning, putting in all that, I'm fine with it. But this is not like at the top of the list, but it's definitely not at the bottom. Not thick, real good powdery, gluten free. You know, it's good for you. You know. <laughs> Not messing with the aftertaste and this is the only one that i'm not messing with the aftertaste with see you guys later check out the website get this open now check out the website y'all you know thank you guys for y'all support i am making 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 any special orders just inbox me on the website thank you Woo. good morning y'all if you go to my YouTube channel, click on one of my videos and then hit that arrow on my description box and hit that link. You'll go right to me and my son's apparel we have with Spread Shirt. Basically, if you make a purchase on here to help us with my channel. Also, everything on this channel is for the parents and the infants or children to match. And soon we'll be coming up with things for couples to match each other. Thank you guys so much for the support. We love you.